All right, I will be solving a SQL question that will show you how to calculate running total in SQL. The question is, write a query to get the cumulative number of new users added by day with the total reset every month. We have given a table called users that has column as ID, name, and created at which is the date. We want to get the result that will give us the date and cumulative users for those dates, but it resets every month. Cumulative means something that is getting bigger in number. For example, on January 28, one user created the account. Cumulative starts at one. Then on January 29, five users created the account. Cumulative users become six because one plus five equals six. Similarly, on January 30, we had, we gained 15 users. Cumulative users became 21 because it's adding as six plus 15 equals 21. But now if you see here, January 31 did the same, but when we hit February, it reset the cumulative users. So instead of 25 plus seven, it is starting as seven. So February 1st, we gained seven users. Cumul cumulative users are seven. On February 2nd, we gained one user. Seven plus one equals eight. This is what we want to show based on this question. So let's solve it in SQL. All right, before I start solving this question, let's see what we have in users table. What are the columns that we are working with? So I'm gonna do select all from users, press F5 to execute or run the query. And I will get ID column, name column, created at column and if you see the data type here is date time this 0000 represents time since i don't have any time uh, showing in here it's only showing 00 for you to solve this question i will be using common table expression as well as analytic function in order to use common table expression we write our query as with CTES. Within parentheses, you'll write here your query that you want to run in your common table expression. And then what you do is select all from common table expression. So whatever will go in these parentheses, I can simply select all of it and it will give me the result because I'm selecting all from common table expression. So I will be writing first select cost created at as date since I don't want the time so I'm changing the format as date only just give me date and I will give it name again as created at just for simplicity comma I can actually write it here, comma, count ID as user count from users. Then I have to group it by, group by, cast created as date, copy paste. Since I'm using count function, I have to use group by function here. Now, if I run this, let's see what I get. I am getting created at date column without the time. I'm getting user count. So on January 28, I had one user. January 29, I gained five users. January 30, 30 15, 4, 7, 1, and so on. Now, we want to solve this question we want to show cumulative number of new users 
added by day with total reset every month. So here they are asking you to accumulate, add those numbers of users, then reset every month. How we're gonna do it is, I'm gonna take this away. Now what I'm gonna do from this common table and expression, I'm gonna write my query as select. I want this column because I want to show the dates created at comma. Now I want this column user count. So created at column user count column. And now I will be writing my analytic function to get the cumulative count sum user count over partition by we want the total reset every month if you see i have date as year month and day so i will write it as year created at so i'm asking to do partition by year comma and month as well created at order by created at as cumulative count from CTE which is common table expression let's run this hit F5 and see what we get here we go this is the result created the users created the account on January 28 user count was one so cumulated count cumulative count starts at one then on january 29 which is the same month we gain five more users one plus five equals six my cumulative count became six january 3rd we gained 15 cumulative count became 21 on 31st we gain another four users Cumulative count became 25. When we came to February, which is 2022, February 1st, instead of this adding up 25 plus seven and give me the cumulative count, this got reset. Why? Because I put in the, con I put in my analytic condition as partition by year as well as month. So it's partitioning, it's resetting on month when the new month started after january and i gained seven users it started from seven as cumulative count instead of 25 plus seven now you see on february 2nd i gained another user and my total cumulative users became seven plus one equals eight this is how you solve this query and get the running total in SQL. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you really liked it, please like and subscribe this video and share it with your friends.